Hi, I'm Sam King. I study naval architecture at the University of Tasmania. And I'm a full-time sailor. It's my passion, my work, and it's what I love. I got introduced to sailing by chance. My, uh, my grandma was taking me for a walk along the, the foreshore here and there was a sailing school on here at the Royal Yacht Club of Tasmania. Enrolled on the day and haven't stopped coming here every Saturday since. The best thing about sailing is the, the friends you meet, the fun you have, and being out on the water, powered by the wind, and just having fun. There's a lot of silence and a lot of noise, but everything's very natural. I've been Tasmania's top laser sailor for quite a number of years since I started sailing them. I'm number six ranked in Australia and this year I get my first chance to qualify for the Olympics in Paris. Ever since my first time sailing, I've wanted to race and whenever I race, I want to win. There's lots of pressure as my ranking gets better in Australia and the world, but I'm lucky to have the support network through the University of Tasmania and the Tasmanian Institute of Sport and their elite athlete partnership. The university has been very supportive of my Olympic campaign. I'm allowed to change the course structure a little bit to suit my needs. If I've got a competition in Europe or I've got a training camp in Sydney or West Australia, the university works with me and we can help tailor what I need to do for my sailing and combine that with the university requirements. I'm studying a, a Bachelor of Engineering specialising in Naval Architecture. Choosing the University of Tasmania has never been a hard decision for me. It was always this degree and this university. The naval architecture is basically designing boats or systems for boats. Where I want to take it is to America's Cup Racing, which is the, perhaps the other pinnacle of sailing. It's a big design race and I just love the high performance aspect of that. And I think that I could add a lot to any America's Cup team. The University Games in 2022 was my first games representing UTAS. We went into it, I'd say, as favourites, and I took a lot of game to the university, <laughs> allowing us extra training time and more resources. And so I had a lot of pressure going in and the whole team felt it. But we came out with the win and the team was so stoked. Training for sailing is quite broad. We do a lot of different kind of cross training. I think my favourite is cycling. We're so lucky to have mountains all around us and hills and plenty of great mountain biking tracks. We're surrounded by beautiful scenes in every direction. And this is what I tell everyone. Like they ask me why I haven't left and I tell them to come here and visit. My mates are the, the best at keeping me grounded. They've never thought of sailing as a real sport. They'll always tell me that. It doesn't matter what competitions I win, it's still not enough to get respect. <laughs> this might sound odd listening to it, but the Olympics is just a small dream of mine and my long game is I want to be someone designing and sailing on an America's Cup boat, kind of like John Burchin and Ben Lexon put together.